This is Bumper to Bumper TV. Mazda managed to check off nearly all of the boxes when it launched the CX-5 crossover a couple of years ago. It was a nimble unit with cargo and passenger space, a new Skyactiv drivetrain, and an attractive price point to compete in the segment. So for the 2014 model year, the designers went for something that was lacking in the original platform. To start with, the GT or Touring model now comes with upgraded 19-inch wheels and tires. One of the biggest changes is under the hood, where the Skyactiv technology is put to use. There is now a 2.5-liter four-cylinder engine available. This plant is rated at 184 horsepower and 185 foot-pounds of torque. Linked to neither a refined all-wheel or front-wheel drive transmission, the power plant delivers improved driving experience with comparable fuel economy. Options also include Smart City Brake Support. It's a system that uses a sensor to reduce engine power and apply the brakes at low speed to avoid a collision. This is usually a feature found on luxury vehicles. Front seat passengers get the usual amount of cabin space and that privilege extends to the second row with extra footwell space, something that's appreciated by both people and packages which can be hidden under the front seats. One of the reasons crossovers are attractive to the public is cargo space. With the second row of seats up, that's 34 cubic feet, and it grows to 65 cubic feet to hold stuff when they're folded down. The CX-5 can be used to pull things, but don't get too ambitious. Its tow rating tops out at 2,000 pounds, about enough to pull a subcompact and not much else. So forget about bringing the cabin cruiser along. In a segment where nearly every manufacturer has an offering, the Mazda CX-5 is a well-executed vehicle. While most others are using off-the-shelf technology, the brand's embrace of the proprietary Skyactiv drive system offers enough difference to make the crossover a functional and unique alternative to its competitors. This is Greg Morrison. We want to know what you think, so email us. The address is bumper to bumper tv at cs.com.